Hello everyone, Terry Cruz here, and this is NHL 24 on EA Sports. Hello everyone, Silver Spoon here, and welcome to another rival matchup of NHL. This is where we are bringing out for the next game, as we're about to be seeing a one of a Pennsylvania showdown. In between of the two teams in the town, as we're about to be seeing it in between for the toughest matchup that we have seen it before. The all-time favorite of Philadelphia, the Flyers. And they are taking on against the other team, the Steel City of Pittsburgh, of the Penguins. Now let's talk about those two in between the Flyers and the Penguins. It's all what it takes for enough to take all of them. And it's a both team competing in NHL's Eastern Conference Metropolitan Division. This rivalry was begun in 1967, when the teams were introduced into the NHL's next six to make the expansion wave right in between. The rivalry exists due to divisional alignment and geographic locations, as both teams play in the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania. And yes, they definitely met the Stanley Cup playoffs four times in 11 years, from 2008 to 2018, strengthening the rivalry. That's what happens now, they're trying to make this what happened. 1989 was a division final, so the Flyers have won four over three by Pittsburgh Penguins. Then in 1997 was the conference quarterfinals. Flyers have already gotten 4 to 1 on a great run out to blow out the Penguins. Then, in the 2000s, they also did it again. But in 2008, the Penguins won right over the Flyers with 4 to 1. 2009 was the same thing as well. But 2012 keep on back again, as it does turn out to be a quarterfinals victory of the Flyers 4 and 2. And finally, in 2018, it was the first round that happened here on the start run of the bracket, where Penguins went against the Flyers 4-2. Now, we're here for the great season matchup. Let's have a look here at the Flyers and for the Penguins. We have this Travis Costney, then it's Carter Hart, which will be the starting goaltender for the Flyers. Then it's Sean Couture that will be playing us here for tonight. And on the other side, we have is the Pittsburgh Penguins. Sidney Crosby is the favorite player from the captain range in with the Penguins. Then it's Eric Carlson, and finally, and Jenny Malkin. And your starting goaltender will be Tristan Jari. Now, let's send you down to PPG Paints Arena, as right now I have the next commentary up. It's all turned for nothing. OJ, along with the other crews as much, as we have is Terry Cruz, and then across on the other end look I have is Ultra Beast, and finally the center ice is Son of Beast. I'll be back here with the post game show. I'll see you guys later. Let's roll. Pen showdown. Here we go. Hey everyone, it's OJ along with Terry Cruz and the Cranitate Group. This is the rival week of Pennsylvania. Well, we're about to get set underway here in BBG Paints Arena, as right now with me, OJ, Terry Cruz, and all of us are standing by. It's go time. On a start run, taking it down right now, as Jerry will have to close it up here on the corner on his side, getting ready for the face-off. For the Penguins and the Flyers, they have already have done so much of the attempts that they were doing this before, back in the regular season that they have done in between right and two. The Zones is a very tricky one to take all of them their takes, but this time, it does happen to be now, they need to do all their proof work. You know, the hard thing about him that everybody has been going through. He scores! First goal of the night is Sidney Crosby! That will be a slow one for a wonderful thing of the Penguins. You could call this one here. If Sidney Crosby knows that he's got a great control out of it, he made that backhand, make that one shuffle motion, and then hit off the goaltender on Hart. That turned to be a little bit hard enough to get right past through it. He had that great look. 
And let me say right now, it is all because, like, you know, Sidney Crosby is, like, a really good PA guy, and he never really felt like he was all of it before, before his training career turned to be, like, way beyond the mark. I never noticed that it was going to be happening like that. But let me say this, it's all turning out to be one time to another. Exactly true. I know, man. It turned to be like a, it's the best game ever. But make that one feel possible enough. They're going to make that one feel that they're going to do it again. Well, let's find out if Sidney Crosby can get three goals. So as I mentioned here before, it, it does turn out to be one of their biggest game of the, uh, of the night. You know, because of like a lot of uh, the pass and in, in between, like it's a clash in between. A and definitely on that occasion, they're doing a lot much harder than they have been doing this before. They're trying to get it away from it in each other, and they never really have done it before, like in between the playoffs of the season. And the regular season turned to be like a very hard one to take. Well, it's also eventually the key that takes it over, but they're trying to get that one a lot harder than they were doing it. So, looks like we're going to see what happens if we're going to get right back into that. Well, let's see how it does turn out. On oh, the shot! Stop away by Jari! He has that first save of the night, trying to be on a good run to go, perhaps. You just really saw that it's a big clank on Sealer, and that turned to be on Malkin to get away with that. I've got a good look here as right now Eric Carlson has an ultimate send it pass in between to take the zone and pressure. He's keeping an eye on a stranger and wants to maintain it well. Constantly is ultimately a better performance, but he may have another chance to do it. These are two runs I'll be trying to keep an eye on in between of Constantly and also Erickson to give it off again to the uh, side of the player. Back to you guys. Carlson gave it over to Smith and right now into the right left side of his zone. To send the pass off! Hart with the stop! Smith battling along the board. Kicks the puck over now to Zaharna. Zaharna in trouble now. Recovers it. On the back end! Stop away by Hart. Lockton will take it over into the left side of a wing. Takes a shot and Jari will take the save here. And this one will not be a penalty for Philadelphia as they will still have their possession. Oh, he lost that one with the puck. Trying to do some a little slick move. Well, I don't know if this was going to be a lot tricky to take over it, but taking it right right around from the back of the net, it may be a hard one to take. I mean, don't let that one keep on going. Oh, lost that puck right away, and now it's a Zemuel. We'll have that one right away. Now here's Ferrari. We will have that one across. He lost the puck, and it goes up into the bench. Both teams are ready to take the face off. Penguins are going to start one with a 1 0 lead over Flyers. Flyers wins the face off. York off to Sahim. Right to Frost. Frost shot! Stop away by Jari, and it goes right out of play into the netting. I never see this one. That's a big smack now. Watch out with that. That's a hard one. Oh man. Incoming alert. Watch out. Take cover. Oh yeah. Really tough one it is, however, but I never see what it looks like. Turn to be very hard. Jari holds the save with only 14 11 to go in the first period of the game. Off to win again is Latay. He's been covered up. Lost that puck and now gets it up. Oh, Jari made up save inbound. And we'll have to hold up from here with another face off coming up. You got that clearly right away because that's what Jari has been doing. He just showed up. He just made the quick response out of it. With the win, New York fires away. It goes with the default deflection. That's stopped by Jari. Latane right over to the left. Looks to his teammate to find Graves, and now Art Archura has the puck. Into the Flyers' territory. Lost that puck. Hart holds it up. And we'll have that whistle about, ready for another face-off, which is only 13 10 to go. These two guys are really on a hard one to take the attackers in there, as it's still a one nothing lead. Crosby wins the faceoff. Forrester takes it over. Forrester on the attack. One on one. On a shot, he scores. He ties the game up. 
That's Atkinson with the shot, and it's 237 goals. You never get away with this one. Atkinson really got that one after Forster had that one with the pass. That's a good move to make that connection work. You know this pass angle has been turning like it's a it's an eye on a stick carry on. And you know when you beat over the goaltender, you just really make that one connection work. This offense has gotten a great, pretty good at trying to blind it out, and that's how you beat them right away. Two teams are tied up right now with only one, and it's only 12.52 left to go in the first period. I can sit with the first goal, looking to get two more in this game. Carlson to Grunzett Snell. That will stop here by Hart. Set nine over to Forster. Forster steps side in the move. Block the shot. Rebound. Hit off the goal post. Grunzett Snell right over again to Rust. He's now on the right side of it and looking it over. Crosby look over. Hard stop. Sark's going to hold that up here. Take that everybody with a breath and ready for the face off. In this range of the midway mark of the period, it's tied up now. And then we'll put up a win as Walker's in the corner of the box. And there we got a delayed penalty as a referee has been signaling it on for the Pittsburgh. You know, the Penguins are not really the ultimate favorite out there. They were just getting a little bit of a head start on a choppy motion. This is not going to turn out that good. And this is what happens. They're going to get the first pager call. Yeah, that's what happens now. Blue Jets now has got that just slash. He's in a penalty box. First power play is coming up here with just 11.42 to go in the first period as the Flyers will take their first power play of the night. Up in the faceoff now as the main advantage is on for Philadelphia. The win puts up for the Flyers. He gets it off to York on a slap shot. Almost went to flick it in, but it stayed out of the net. Nyheta flares it, clears it out. York takes it over. Shot stop by Charlie. Near it down, there's under 11 minutes remaining, and Frosted team is still looking over it. I never saw that Redwell had that one a little bit of choppy motion out there, and it looks like they're trying to ballot. It. it looks like he was just trying to be picking on it. I don't know what to do with that guy, but it's not really turning along that better. Face off coming up here for the Flyers, Flyers and the Penguins. The win puts up again. Walker shot's been blocked by Zaharna. Tries to keep him bound. Walker shot. Gloved away by Jari. Near the midway mark of the period. Still looking to get a score run to beat everyone. The win puts it for O'Connor. Loses the puck. O'Connor takes it back. Frost. Fires away. The shot was too wide. And it goes right back to Tippett. On to Farby, he scores! That takes his first goal here for a power play for the Phillip Flyers. He has 61. Even if that calls in for the kind of bound to beat Jari, that might be a one thing that can go for the count on. You know what Farby does? He likes to take his cross-check motion. When he goes right toward it, he loves to do some a little bit of sidestep and then put it right toward net. That's where the goal comes in. Turn out great. I know that Farby was doing a lot of the cross-stepping motion, but don't get us uncomfortable, guys, because you know he's been training a lot of hockey of his motion run on every games, and now this one comes in. It's hard enough to try to like keep him out of here, but it's going to be a hard one to try to keep it up. We'll see how well he does if he gets two more. Back to you. The Flyers and the Penguins are ready to take an hour face-off attack. Now the win puts up for the Penguins. And Shea has that puck over to get into now. Kutitzel right into the right. To Ross! Hart stopped it away just like under a midway mark of the period. It's 9.33 left to go. In all calls for... Ivan Malkin has an unstoppable force to take all this reputation. 
He has a lot of force inbounding when he can try to like keep it going without getting taken down. It's a hard one to try to take the steal out of him, but we'll see what he does. He scores! Malkin! That's what you do! That's when you get the goal to tie back in! If Malkin had that one firing range, it goes right towards it. It's on to a, a, a sharp angle. When you go over this with a pass angle, you just didn't see what was going to happen like that. And that one turns right toward the corner of the net. That turned like that before and after. Penguins and the Flyers have tied up this game with only 9.17 to go. They're having a little bit of a trouble issue here. Just uh, parts of his uh, period in the game. But now they have it through. Oh, he's trying to push it out, but it's hard to deny it. It keeps it out. That was close call. Mm -hmm. I never see when it goes like this. Well, good stop on that run. You can't just take get, away, get over with the goalie. We just now with the puck. Now finds Crosby and now onto the right side of it. Fires away! Hard with the stop. We're nearing down on the mark of 18 left to go. Still a tie game. Now we need to do some more. They're still tied up right now. And need to look for another goal. Flyers wins the face off. Here's York. He will have that puck here right again to Atkinson. Two on one opportunity. Lost that puck into the corner of the board. Here he goes. And that shot stopped again by Jari. Lost that one as Malkin gives it over to Akira. Akira, he pass. And he goes right over again to Hinskovraza. Stopped away by Hart. York rebounds the puck. Philadelphia on the inbound in, into the Penguins' territory. Give off to Atkinson. On the full bridge team. Oh, good stop by a defender. And now they will have to rebound it as Pittsburgh has it caught up. Pinkerchka lets their team in the Flyers territory. Trying to shoot in. Hart denies the shot. 6.31 to go in the first period. It's still looking coming in clean in between Ajari and Hart. Maybe. I don't know if it's going to be happening like that, but I never see what's going to happen if there is another changeoff to go with the same. Maybe it might be a tough one. You'll never know. I just got a lot of feelings right now. Well... You'll see. The win puts up there as right now Walker has the team back into the Flyers to the Penguins territory. Full range of motion to tip it. It takes it away. Graves has the puck. Toward the right slot into O'Connor on the left. Stays from the corner, finds Graves, out to O'Connor. And Latay outside. Full pressure ahead. Backhand has been blocked by Walker. He goes down and Tippett has to recover. Looking it over. Save me by Jari. Now let's hang with the puck, just under five minutes to go in the first period. Into O'Connor, and a shot! Hat saved by Hart. And goes over, blocked away, rejected as the broken stick appears. Well, it's going to have to uh, replace a new one. And then after the first period, they're going to have to clear it out. And a shot! Good stop by Jari. Hold oh, that puck here with only 4.7 to go. Nearing down by the end of the first period. Both teams are set, ready for the faceoff. It's still a tie game. They need to look for the open goal in between. Latang wins the faceoff. Carlson with the puck. Looking to send it away. It's crossover move. Hart with the save. Malkin finds a Zahana. It's blocked up. York takes the puck over and now off to Senheim. Senheim right with the 2 on 1 offense. Malkin takes it over. Has that pass right over again to Zagorna. Zagorna right toward in the middle. The slot! Hart stopping away. 
York with the puck inbound with the Flyers regaining more groups. Brink onto the right side. Recovers. Pass to Farby. Good time stop by Jari. Farby on the corner of the boards. York recovers it. 220 left. Brink shot. Blocked away. Good crunch down enforcement. But really looking to get more gear. Yeah, that might be a tough one to range on. It's a great to tough to defend that. Jory stuck. Henderson with the puck. Now off to Carlson. Two on one opportunity. Stop by Hart. Now over to get Atkinson. Over now to St. High. Now over again. Get York back to Forster. Forster right on the way on the right. Over now again. No penalty on Pittsburgh. Can't control the puck. One minute remaining in the first period. And Oshasa going to shoot it. And he's able to stop that one here as Hart picks up another save. You're back to Atkinson. In the attacking zone. Good stop by Jari. Back to Sennheim. Atkinson away. Shoots. Denies the run. He really got to pick that one up already. Maybe a bigger moment. That's a great stop to take away from him. And he to the tag. It's blocked. And that will end the first period. Both teams on aggressive front looking to get a lead off in the second period. Be right back after this. Welcome back to the second period, and we're about to get this thing started underway in Pittsburgh. They are a tough team right now as we start underway in the second period. With my guys going to recap, let's have your takes in between of Terry and Ultra Beast. Well, I must tell you now, they, they were really on a good focusing attackers. They've really been starting to shut them down away, but I can't really tell how much they were doing this. They were trying to, like, leave it out. They are trying to, like, put it back in the force suit. When the head coach was giving directions, I mean, you got to give him more uh, room, room, and you got to show up. This is, a, like, a hard one to make a transition out of them. They're trying to get over this, and they've got to do with their deal to try to take them out. Hart saw it. And, and you know that Hart was really, like, turning to be a, a tough one and could make the release spin out of it. It really has to be turning out just hard to try to stay in contact when you go with the player inbound. And I must say, it is really tough to be honored, you know. You're never gonna let us, that, like, you're never gonna, like, try to, like, beat the odd man rush if you're gonna try and, like, keep it over this point. You're trying to get away with that, you don't wanna get them off of that comfortable position. If you're joining us here for the uh, second period of the game, it is still tied up by Philadelphia and Pittsburgh. Crosby wins the face up. He finds Carlson shot that went wide. Sennheim with the puck and the Flyers will have their possession as Atkinson into the Pittsburgh zone. York with the puck. Crosby takes it over. Oh, he tried to go over the back end, but it went so too soon. Atkinson lost the puck as Gusek Snell over again. Try to take the puck and bounce. Puck in flyer zone, finding Couture. Atkinson with the puck now into the right side. Over now to Couture. And a cover bound. Shot went wide. He finds Crosby. Gives it over again to Smith. Sliding in motion. Shot went fired as Hart takes it over to York. He off to Couture. He finds Cuntney. Couldn't see over Pedersen lost that one with the puck. Looking against from zone, knocking over again to Smith. Shot stopped. Flyers regain the group as York takes it back to Lacton. Lacton over now to Tippett. Tippett on inbound to Conesi. It's stopped away by Tristan Jari. He's really on onto a heavy heap off run. He got a big reaction. Just trying to keep it over it if you can't get away with that. So Horny pucks it over, shot. Blocked away. It now goes back over again to Pittsburgh. Back to Malkin. Tries to go behind the net. 
He takes it back and he says, no, no, get off. Zahorna trying to take it over it. Watch out with the push call. Malkin shot. Oh, he just had that heart save. So now in with the puck. Two on one opportunity. All team in the zone. Fires away. Jari stop. The tango we're down with 14 10 remaining by. Any attacking bound. Barney Smith. Club save by heart. He will offer the whistle here with only 13.57 to go in a second period. On those two team attackers, it's still time. Wynn puts up for Pittsburgh. Here's a 10 shot. Rebound again. Hard stop away. Oh my goodness, that is a good cutting bound. He would have had that one in there, but it's still denied. Yeah, I'm not pretty sure how much they're going to get there done. But it may not be tough enough if they're going to get another goal with that. He's trying to, like, shut them down. Put on lockdown defense. Sealer into the corner of the box. He now finds Walker. Closes up the gap. Runs it over. Now finding again to bring. Farby right toward the right slot. Sealer with the puck. In range, the shot where the backhand went high up toward the glass. Now we cover the puck. Out of the way, shot stopped by Chari. Farby recovers the puck. Try to beat him, he scores. They're back in the lead as Farby with 22 goals, and they're back up to get more. Well, they might be saying what happens. Chris Latay, what are you doing? He's trying to get it out of here. But look what's what happened to Farmy. If he made that one in there, it just turned over. And Latang just went short. I'm really stunned at what happened right now, but it, this is like turning out to be a little bit too much out of him. Farmy had two goals? That's impossible. They're trying to get over this one if they can. Hard stop. Two goals for now, looking to get one more to get a hat trick. Here's Katez with the puck. 12 minutes gone by in the second period. Spin on the move. He way out of focus that time and it goes wide off to the board. Here's the tag. He now finds again to O'Connor. Looks to Raquel. Raquel right toward the left slant. Over to Eller. Trying to rebound him but his heart takes it over. Snaps the puck. Ready for another face off. I don't see what the point is. It looks like it's a class shot take. Might be taking it over with the puck. Ease off. Now for another win for the Flyers. He now gives it over to Atkinson. Atkinson on the inbound. Trying to take it over. And it's another stop again by Charlie. Crosby finds again to Carlson. He now has it over again on the left swing of the slot. Crosby shot! Trying to tie it, but it's denied by Hart. Atkinson right over now into the Flyers to the Penn's territory. Couture over again. Atkinson! Good takedown defense. Set so over Carlson. Over now again to Russ. Russ finds Crosby to move around. It's Hart denies the shot. What a good piece of it! Keep it out and stay out. If there's some good ways to try and like get out and stay out, you never never gonna know if there's like a fire alert and you're gonna like try to like keep it over it. You've got protection, you got it right. Here's the open the puck. Oh, good take over again. But not this time as Lockton takes it over and now finds York. Pansy right over again on the white slot. Near half is Carlson. He passed to Pedersen. He lost that one as Lockton takes it over. In the Penguins territory, tip it shot. Garnasi shot, he scores. That is another goal for Philadelphia Flyers. They have been on the run to do it again. I can't tell you that. I constantly have that backhand. We really got in a lot of it. You know how much he's been doing it? A lot. 
I can't tell you how much he's been going at because if Owen Tippett give it over again to Consney, that's a hard one to take the resist out of that. He's got a pretty deep score. Now for the win, here's Peterson fighting Carlson. Carlson on the back end and release it! Stop the way! Mark goes down and makes another save with 8.42 to go. Still a lot of time left in the second period of the frame. Flyers are going to start run to make the comeback switch off. Over by two. Walker with the puck and now into the right side of the wing. In the Penguins territory. Good stop! That puts up another for Jari. Lockton over again right into the back slot. Jari! Nice catch and releases. Holds on to his chest and ready for the faceoff. Still getting a lot much harder than they are. Putting up a risk. But they're trying to put up another faceoff. Pedersen has that puck. Lost that one. Crossover again. Shoots and he scores! Oh my goodness! Players are already on the fly attackers. Break with his first goal in the game. They now have the extension. Let me tell you why. Because Bobby Brink was really over us. And that puck was like near him. He said, okay, I'll take that. And that one turned it over. That's going to be a, like a hard one to take over this one to go right in between. That's a great help here for the Flyers to take over it. Bobby Brink has that first goal to take over is from his career and he's just been trying to keep it over it. He never has gotten the goal of his releasement, but he is willing to earn his respect and he has finally been taking it over ever since. This one's tough one about everyone has been going for him here, and they're trying to get another one. I'll see if, I have, if there's another one for Brink if he gets another goal. Back to you guys. Ross lost that puck as Brink takes it over, and he finds it again to Farby. Here's the tank, you have that one with only seven minutes gone by in a second. Feed fire! That one stops again by Hart. Sealer with the puck. Over down to Brink. Brink on a release setup. Graves takes it over as good as that with the puck. Try to beat the out man rush. That takes it out. Frost over again to Farby. Oh, he got that quick paint bounce. But not this time as Frost takes it over. Oh, he got that big smack down in the corner right near the wall. Oh man, I never seen what this goes with. That's gonna be a paint earthful painful run. Ouch! Save me! Blocked away! Good stop zone as Hart takes another one. And now Couture on the inbound. Here's Shay, you'll have the bucket right again to Raquel. And now O'Connor will have that one in right up in depth in front. In the attacking zone is O'Connor. Raquel's shot! Blocked by Zeeler. Zeeler on his way down into the Penn's territory. First shot. Try to fucking hit this jar. He picks up another save. Shea goes over to Zahorna. Zahorna right towards the right. Lost that one. Zahorna trying to recover it. But now it's York. Takes it over. A takeaway look. Over to Forster. Malkin. Good takeaway from that. Nayana, where did we get a Shea? And now Smith. Here's another one. Tried to look over to Shea, and now finding Malkin shot. It's blocked away as Sam Hine takes it over. He finds again to Connexi. Connexi, right over again, to the right, finding Tippett shot. Hooked by Jari. 3-12 left to remain in the second period, as it's only, only a 5-2 lead. Officials again said they're ready for the face-off. The win for puts up for Crosby. Crossing with the puck. Back to Crosby. Over now again to Gutzepsel. Deep pass to Rust. York takes it over. Try to give off the tippet. Leaves it out. And I with the puck. Oh, that's a little aggressive here. Locked in right over to get on the right side. In the center, Patterson takes it over. On his way down to the Flyers' territory. Pass to Crosby. 
That went wide off. That's been deflected on the defensive player. Carlson takes it over now finding Pedersen. Pedersen lost that one. Recovers it and put it back away. Here comes Carlson's shot. Rebound. Oh, he's going to have to hit that one in tomorrow. Oh, that wasn't going to be a tough one in range. If Crosby would have had that back right behind the net, he would have got lucky. That's going to be a tricky one to take over this. Wow. With the win, he puts it up again. Falpetto went over again to four store. And the attacking's in now. One minute remaining. Good stop by Jory. Keeps it out. Good turn back to Zambula. Right to four store. Tries to give up to Falpetto. Stop at the path saved by Jory. Full pressure away on the Flyers. They leave out. And Oshosa right over into the left side. Blocked away. Tries to give over to Latang. Over to Matthew. Fires it. Denied. And that will be enough as this one time is done. Two periods are already finished, but we got one more period to go. Fires on the extension run. The hope of three. Five two. We'll be right back with you after this. You're watching the Rival Week of NHL 24 on EA Sports. We are down to the last quarter. Hope you're having fun. And it's right now the last one to take. And we are all set. As for the Flyers, they already have been scoring three goals in this game. And it looks like they're on the extension run over the Pittsburgh Penguins. Let's have your take here, guys, of your ultimate of how the Flyers have done. Pretty accomplishment out there. They really are selling up their settle down to try to pick up the smackdown in, in between. It really is going to be a hard one to take. But if the Penguins are going to come back out there, let's find out if they would. Well, I'm not really sure if they're going to be able to take that one over it, but they're really over this. On a stop run, it's right to like, take over this inbound. You're never going to get that easy. That's a tricky one to make that move. There's another one for Crosby. He lost that puck. It's four straight to give to York. Two on one opportunity. Lost that one as Rust gives it to Latang. He's in the Flyers territory. Crosby shot, stopped by York. As Rust, as Hart takes another one. He finds Forster. Forster gets to Caracasio. Jari makes a save. 18-3 left to go in the third period. Looking to get a revenge for Pittsburgh Penguins with another goal. And make it a close game. With the win, here's Walker. Lost that puck as Latani takes it over. He's on his way down looking for help. Give over to Walker. Okay. Oh, it's hurt with the stop. And that bad pass takes it over. Forster takes it over and he takes a smack. Behind the cage is the tang. Off to Malkin. Pittsburgh back into the offense zone. Try to beat the open. And it's stopped by Hart. Over back to Zahana. Malkin on the backhand shot. Denied. Forster lost that puck, give back to Pedersen. He was Latay, open look, wide off the range as Walker takes the puck away. Forster lost that puck and now he will give it over again to Zahorna. On the cut of Mount, stop again by Hart. Malkin takes it over. Walker on the full pressure. Oh, hello! Oh, this one's big. I never see what's gonna happen like that. Smith lost the puck. We recover! It's way wide. Lantern Valley along the board. El Petty, El Petio lost that puck and Smith takes it over. Now finding Malkin over again to cross him. Rebound by Pedersen. Shot stopped! El Petio with the puck. He now finds it over again as Emula. 
over now to Lantern. Shall I wear wide? It's Patterson takes it over now again to O'Connor. Under 15 minutes remaining in the third period, looking to get another one. And the release it! Stop my heart! He's having me look with the puck. Flyers in the regaining group here now, looking for our next step. Trying to change it up. Without the new line change, Constantine gives it back to Palpetio. He loses the puck. And now O'Connor has it. Lost that one. Palpetio trying to hold on. Tippett takes it over. And now it's swing pass. Frost carries offside for Philadelphia. You're not really easy enough to say this. They have been looking like they were wanting to make a smack out of him. But they're trying to get out of here as soon as they can. They don't want to get away with this. They're losing all of it, and this is a lot of pressure in here trying to keep them out of here. Big sight. Crosby losing the puck. Calling for a big backup. Farvey in a shot. Three goals. Won't take it in as it went wide. Patterson give off to Russ. Looks like he's had a bit Russ. He could go for it. With the shot, Crosby. He lost that one as Hart takes a stop. Oh, uh, I thought that Crosby would have had that one in the motion. That could be a beauty backhand. Crosby gives the rust. Stick lifted and back to Brink. Over now to Farby. Cut him down. He lost that one. Crosby gives to Crosby. On his way down. Gujicel to try to go over and gloved it away. York battling for the puck. Loses that one as Russ takes it over. Behind the net, and that one gets it out of the way. Sondheim with the puck. 11 minutes gone by in the third period. Still a 5-2 game lead. In towards the right. Frost shot, rebound, stopped by Jari. Calls it again to Archeria. Akiri with the puck right over into the right side of the swing. Takes the recover. Gray, shots blocked. Rebound again, Hart stuck. Set on with the puck. Goes down, as nine now it goes back over again to Declaris. The closer is. Stop again here by Jerry. Pittsburgh back the airway as the Penguins are trying to regroup their position. They gotta look for some help. Sure shot, make the bottle out of here. They're back down by two, and they're looking to get another one. Well, this is a fire one, and you can say he's, he's trying to hit it up. Right on top of the crossbar, it goes way up high, and that one just hit right towards it. The bottle comes flying out. That is a huge one. I can't believe this one. It really is going to be like a lot of them, and they're trying to like do it for the last time. They don't want to get away with this. Lutain with the assist, back down by two, it's a 5-3 game. Win for the Penguins. Riz finds Nayano. Nayano giving it over again. For sure, to get a shot, stop by Hart. Oh my, Hart is on the muscle. He is still looking for his feedback. And caught top one he called for. They're trying to like make a stop run. With the win, Latang lost that puck as Walker takes it over. We passed the midway mark of the period as Walker is on his way down. And now uh, C lost it. Charlie scores! Oh boy, looks like the Flyers are taking it over. They have never won each game in the season. Well, that is just going to be a look at Harvin because Sean Katori, he got that trapped. He just really got a little over it, and I said, got you, and that, he puts him in. That's what happens now, because the Katuri had that goal, it got him clear. So Jari is out of here, unfortunately for now, the Pittsburgh Penguins, the player is already out, he's in the medical attention, as we got that one in an update. Thank, thanks guys, I really have just saw that one, the medical attention has been really turning it over uh, since. He's may not be an impressive on a start run, but he's been turning it over just like a countless hours, and he's been trying to keep it out of here. 
This range is like going to be a hard one to take over, and, and as of right now, you'll be out of here, and that will be suspended for this part of the game. Back to you. Forster finds over the game to Katori. Katori lost that punt, and Shea takes it over to Akira. Takes a punch as Forster takes it over. Katori looking to get another one, and they go wide off the mark. Battling for the loose puck. Puck clears out of the zone. 720 left to go. Valpedio with the puck. Tries to swipe it across. Gives back to Forster shot. Jerry stop. Looks like he's now leaving it with us here at that moment as he picks up another save. Another one coming in down. It's 6 to 3, Flyers up again. They are on the star one, and they are back in the power play, looking to get another postseason to get into the game. We never seen the Flyers that they were coming in there, but that was all it took. But they are trying to keep it out. Especially, uh, I just have to say that Philly Flyers, ugh, I am never going to know anything of what this turned out. They're a pretty hard team, just like the Devils and the Rangers. But this might be a hard one for the Flyers to take on against the Islanders. They're really hard tough one that they're trying to get out of here. Show you with the cut of bound. Lost that one as Raquel takes it back. Well, you got to put back out down and says, no, no, not for you. Carnage C went right over again, right onto this left slot. Tries to clean the paint. Looking back. Jari stopped away as Tippett takes it over, battling for the puck. Over to Kansasi, shot stopped by Jari. Shady pass to Smith. He's on a full breakaway chain. Fires away, it's stopped again by Hart. York on the way down. Tries it back step to St. Hein. Listen out of the zone. The Penguins regain the group as Patterson get back over again to Smith. Smith fouling for the puck on the board chain. And it's recovered by Patterson. Ross takes it over and now finds Smith. 345 left to remain in the third period. Still need to go with some other ideas. Fires away, scores! Rocket Blast one time goal by Sidney Crosby. 552 goals this game. Yeah, that's a good look. And you can't just say that Sidney Crosby is like going over. After a rust, he made the thunderclap motion. That beats him over the goaltender, all right, from Hart. And that one turned to be over from here. It's excellent now. You never know when it's going to be like happening to everyone else. That Sidney Crosby is trying to like keep it over. Close out the game, nothing you can't get away with that. Crosby has two of this game, it's right now, it goes back to Gutsuk Snow. He rebounds again, oh, trying to get three goals, but it stayed out. Russ tries it over, cross the shot, Crosby inbound, hurt stop, oh my goodness, he is on a heavy hit run. He's been going all over it. I never see what Sidney Crosby's trying to get over this one. We have an update on this one. Let's go down to center beats. Currency has been always been keeping an eyes on this game. He's like a heavy, true lifetime. He's ultimately a best known performance of his best player of the game. He might be looking for himself to like keep their team alive in for the postseason. So they give off to Farby. Farby right towards the left. Tries to beat him, and Jari puts up a stop. 2.18 left to remain in the third period here, down by two. Now for another face-off attack. Flyers still up ahead. He puts up another win as Walker takes it over. Pushes out. Zeeler the Forster shot. Locked. Here comes Crosby. He's on a full range and he went wiped down. Forster takes it over. Forster, over and out again, rebound, oh, denied by the goaltender. Atkinson takes it over, Jari stop. Under 90 seconds in the third period, trying to see if they can get a full man pressure on. 
Looks like the time is winding down and just only 128 to go in the third period. And Crosby wins it on a faceoff. So Horny with the dead. Does Carlson and now find Smith? Extra skaters on for the Penguins. Missed that one. Carlson has that puck. Try to keep it out. No penalty call on, on uh, Philadelphia. Deep fire shot stopped by Hart. Looks like a time is just wasting down. Walker will have to send their team up. And that takes its fire puck in. You know it's pretty easy right now because Sean Walker really got that deep firing pass, passing to the neutral zone and into the blue line. He just made it from the right from the range and then he got that goal right away. The Philadelphia Flyers have crushed our road game tonight as they beat out the Penguins right in the game of 7-4. As Atkinson and their team have made the win. All eyes on Farby. He has two goals in this game and turning out one of his biggest of the night. So Horna went up and over the wide. And Hart will hold the cover up here with just 10 seconds. Just one more possession in between two teams of the Flyers and Penguins. He makes a win. Hart stops. Still gaining a lot of the most respect in between the two, but the time is winding down. Last face up for the Flyers. And that will do for the game. The Flyers shut them down on the Penguins with a win, and all things thanks goes to Hart. He made that one impressive, and he had that one with a good range of motion. This one is a tough one. I never say that Hart has been like on, on, on an incredible night. I can't really say that after a regular season against the Anaheim Ducks, they're really like a tough one. And I really enjoyed this one, but it's a hard one. You can't just make the win out of it. With OJ, along with Senna Beast, Terry Crews, and Ultra Beast, this has been a presentation of Arrival Week. Thanks for watching, and see you next time. All right, thank you so much. Three star players arrive. Kim Atkinson with the goal assist in three hits, only took a turn to the worst that made that one goal being a goaltender. And Joel Farabee had two goals and a hit, only looking to get three, but it was denied after too soon, so only two counts. And your first star player of the game goes to Sidney Crosby, with two goals and two hits. He is a great one to take the one-time attackers, only take that one with the beat the goaltender. Here's how you did with the total statistics of the game. 57 over 53 for Pittsburgh. 55 over 38 of the hit on Pittsburgh. 727 over 705 on the time on attack. 91 over 89 for Pittsburgh. 26 over 25 for Philadelphia. Only two minute penalty kill was printed up for Pittsburgh and a power play goal was for the Philadelphia Flyers with 54 seconds. That's not that bad actually if they're trying to like keep him out of here for a single time. But all it takes out, you can't win for anything. Flyers make the great win with a free game losing streak. And they have been looking to get all over this one to try to like go for the next season run. If it can try to enter it back. For a home game or away game. Well, you may never know if it's going to happen like that. In the meantime, Silver Spoon is out of here. Peace out folks for a while as the, the rival week of the NHL on EA Sports Style. Thank you all for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to his channel. Follow him on the social media on X, Instagram, and TikTok. Link to the about page. Good night, everybody. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.